This movie wasn't a success in 1940, even with Carol Lombard's name up on the marquee and in the ads. After this movie, she made only three more films, a drama with Charles Lawton called They Knew What They Wanted, and then two comedies, Alfred Hitchcock's Mr. and Mrs. Smith and Ernst Lubitsch's To Be or Not To Be. And then at the age of only 33, Carol Lombard was killed in an airplane accident in 1942 on a flight home to California after a war bond tour. At the time of her death, she was scheduled to immediately go to work on a comedy at Columbia Pictures called They All Kissed the Bride. But Joan Crawford, who was a great friend of Lombard's and Clark Gable's, offered to take over that role, and she turned her entire salary for the part over to the War Relief Fund in Carol Lombard's name. Coming up next, we lighten up things a bit for the final installment in our 24-hour salute to Carol Lombard. It's a romantic comedy set in Paris that also stars Fernand Grave and Ralph Bellamy. Tonight on TCM Summer Under the Stars, something's cooking between Carol Lombard and a chef, two fools for scandal. Then Carol adds zaniness to the golden age of comedy, and Marlon Brando helms his day with a mutiny on the bounty. 